With the Easter weekend just around the corner, the JMPD is on the road, making sure that you get home safe and sound. I'm Paul Palazzi, the executive mayor of the city of Johannesburg, and you're watching Joburg Today. The city of Johannesburg has launched the Easter Road Safety Campaign, which seeks to encourage positive driver behavior and promote passenger safety. Well, it is Easter. It's a very important time for Joburg residents, but it can also be a dangerous time. We've seen in the past many road fatalities during Easter. This is a campaign to remind road users that road safety is a joint responsibility, while as the city we have the responsibility of ensuring that our roads are tarred, that there's road markings, that there's street lighting, there's grass cutting. They too have a responsibility to respect the rules of the road and drive responsibly, not drink and drive. And that is the partnership that we want to have with our residents. We want them all to arrive alive, return to us alive, as we have a city to build together. Well, it's good because it keeps the riffraffs of the road, it makes people aware, and it keeps our drunk drivers at bay and less, less, less accidents. And with officers like that, I, you know, you don't mind getting stopped. This is public safety. It's not only the police. You can see I've got disaster management, I've got EMS, I've got licensing, I've got JMPD. It's a full house. This is what we call it public safety. So public safety will, will is, is going to be all out and ensure that we take care of the taverns, we take care of the illegal churches, we take care of illegal dumping in the inner city. So all these issues. And you must remember that everybody uh, will go to the parks to enjoy themselves. That's where they drink. So even in our parks, we'll be there with our horses to ensure that the people are safe. We don't believe that much of law enforcement. We believe in that we are here to protect the rights, the constitutional rights of everyone. I think it's very important, especially what's going on in South Africa on the roads at the moment. From us is to really wish all our motorists a safe, uh, blessed Easter weekend. Um, let's all drive safely. Let's take care of each other, um, both pedestrians and motorists. Um, this road is uh, for all of us, uh, and so we must make sure that we take care of each other and we arrive safe, you know. Don't drink and drive, don't text and drive. And um, I will also try and pay, play our part as well as, a, as government on ensuring that we maintain the roads because also there's the challenges of potholes and, uh, and sinkholes and all those things. So we are working around the clock to make sure that we claw back on our backlog uh, in the city of Johannesburg. But those that will be traveling outside of the province, please uh, do so um, safely and we wish to see you back um, safe in the, after the Easter season. The, the importance of our and the significance of our partnership with the MMC's office as well as the executive mayor is in fact ensuring that the traveling and the movement and the flow of transportation in and around the city and beyond, given that you know th there's this festive uh, thing around and hype around the Easter period, is to ensure the safety of our commuters and all our communities at large. And our, our partnership, especially with the city of Joburg, ensures that we get our messages across and we get the effectiveness of getting a better and um, you know, a more safer transport. There's too much things going on on the road slightly, too much accidents, people is not um, disciplined on the roads and um, yeah, I think it's very important. The campaign addressed vehicle and driver fitness, drunk driving, illicit substances and bylaw management amongst other things. I'm so proud to be the mayor of a city like Johannesburg. We've invested a lot in public safety. I've seen today the various units within public safety, whether it's JMPD, disaster management, the EMS, licensing. There's great work happening all around. Even disaster management is here. The unity between all the units, the collaboration, coordination. But today we also have transport. We even have one of our, uh, our taxi associations that are here that want to partner with public safety to drive the safety messaging across the taxi industry. That's going to be a big win for us because a lot of the perpetrators of infringements on the road are taxi operators. Well, I want to say to the community of Johannesburg, public safety is here for them. We need their support 
to reduce fatalities on our road, crime, and ensure that we obey all the rules of the city of Johannesburg. The message will trickle down to the associations who are our affiliates, and then via your um, your squad marshals, the vehicles that you see written, t t t the various tax associations, will get the messages there and will distribute pamphlets and messages live to the drivers in the taxi ranks. That's how we ensure. And just in case you need tips on how to stay awake and in control. The most important thing is to, um, to, to stop every 200 kilometers and take a break. The most important thing is that drink water, um, don't drink and drive. Uh, make sure that you are also well, well rested. After at least a two hour drive, take a nap or take a rest, walk around and, uh, and come back and drive. You know? so, and also if it's um, possible, have um, a substitute driver. You know? um, if you're driving with your wife, allow them to drive as well for about an hour or so and you can do so as well. So it's, uh, it's those type of things that we, 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 know we take for granted but they are very, very important. Don't go on the road if, you, if you're not, if you're not uh, awake, so just stay off the road if you're tired. Stop and have a break. I mean, there's nothing else you can really take to pick me up so type of thing, but stop and have a break, you know, don't, don't drive for too long. Educate you take them while you're issuing that citation so that they will remember you, they will never forget you. They will remember that, that officer who helped save their lives.